one of the world's most dreaded Islamist terrorists and Hindu phobes, Ewan Al Zawahiri, deputy to Osama bin Laden, a man who was always metaphorically stuck at the hip to Osama bin Laden, according to the United States president, has been eliminated in a missile strike. The United States used a Hellfire missile to eliminate Ayman Al Zawahiri. Guess where he was? He was in a posh area of Kabul. Viewers, a posh area of Kabul, I'm underlining that word. Why? Because we were told, assured by the Taliban, that they will not be supporting any more any global terrorism or giving shelter to any global terrorist. The Taliban sheltered Osama bin Laden. Once they were out of power, Osama bin Laden tripped across the metaphorical border. I call it metaphorical because it is very ill-defined, the Durand line. And started living in Abbottabad right under the nose of the Pakistani establishment. Here we are told by the New York Times the reverse happened. Once the Taliban came back, Ayman al-Zawahiri, who is one of the most wanted, leaves Pakistan and goes to take advantage of the Taliban's hospitality. What does this confirm to us all, viewers? And I want to show you this map. Look at this map. This is Kabul. Look how close the area where this man was eliminated is to the presidential palace in Kabul where the Taliban has set up its government. Just two and a half kilometers. In the past, Osama bin Laden, if you go to the other map, Osama bin Laden was within 800 meters. He was killed within 800 meters of the Park Military Training Academy in Abbottabad in Pakistan. What does this tell you, viewers? That the Taliban and the Pakistani establishment are still harboring terrorists. India has taken a very hardline position. No talks position against Pakistan, but there is a fear that India was going a little soft on the Taliban. Has the time come now to blacklist the Taliban?